very pleasant the temperature standpoint it's cooled off quite a bit from what we had here the last couple of days temp in the mid 60s Florida won the toss and deferred of the Vanderbilt game a week ago Avery Atkins punting into that phrase and it's blocked blocked and rolling free near the 35 yard line now a scrum and Florida is going to have the ball at the 35 yard line it appears Moving on the field legal touching by the kicking team ball will be placed here first down the sack Jeremy Crawshaw to punt he's an Australian with that win just bombs one and it'll be a touchback Max Johnson leans so heavily on Butte be interesting to see who becomes the primary receiver low line drive punt it is muffed and then retrieved by Xavier Anderson. Jace Chrisman for the extra point. And it is no good. An unlikely win. They went there as 23 point underdogs. Wild game featured six lead changes. Florida actually had a chance to win it on an Evan McPherson field goal from 51, but he missed. And make plays like that to give him a chance to win. They already blocked one punt that wound up going 22 yards. Good decision by Dan Mullen to defer. First year here, he placed Bo Pelini. Jones was on the Minnesota Vikings staff a year ago. Good punt by Crawshaw with the win and a fair catch made by Trey Palmer. Cade York for the extra point and the lead. Avery Atkins is the holder. And that kick is good. Conclusion that his tenure here is over. Yeah, and you know, as a son of a coach. Punted to Trey Palmer, who seems very deep for this punt, given how hard that wind's blowing. And sure enough, the ball comes up well short of where he is. Wobbly nose up kick that will be spotted. Well, the official still walking at the 35 yard line. Didn't get it up into that wind. Line drive kick. Took a good bounce. And a nice roll. The Tigers, an eight point lead with eight and a half to go till halftime. But they are here. A lot of times they get in the car right after their Friday night high yeah. school game ends. Balance of the run and pass. LSU building a big lead. And the extra point, good. And yet the play calling is exactly balanced. 11 runs and 11 passes so far for Florida. And on a very windy day. Fourth punt for Crawshaw. He ran for 28 yards on a fake punt last week against Vandy. Good kick, fair catch made by Trey Palmer. Xavier Henderson back deep. Great kick. Drives Henderson back inside the 15. And he's chopped down at the 23. 66 yards combined on those last two catches of the half by Justin Shorter. Avery Atkins kicking off. It got returned for a touchdown. Turnovers have been their undoing today as well. Wow, well, off the upright. <laughs> well done, Todd. <clears throat> I know you know the answer to this because you saw it last night. It'll be a touchback. Something they have not seen all season. They felt it came to life in the second half. To help with some of that. There's some great food in this part of the country. Lots to choose from for Taste of the Town this week. So matching his career high. 95 receiving yards. I mean, you look at our schedule in the SEC, there are no easy games. He knew coming in here was not going to be any kind of an easy game. Avery Atkins to punt for the sixth time today. Xavier Henderson. Swung down at the 35 yard line. And the extra point for Jace Chrisman to tie it. Quarterback in high school and also an excellent basketball player game for 
Ty Davis Price, 25 carries, 204 yards. Time meeting between these two teams. Touchback. Quarter, and then he came right back on the field and delivered. A rare kickoff return in this game, and it's the dangerous Trey Palmer. Trey Palmer tripped up by the kicker, Chrisman. Jade York had some intrigue to what was also a wacky game. And I think all shoes will remain on feet. 